Hello, Donald. Malaya, what are you doing here? We're not supposed to... I, I told you I'd be home in about five o'clock. Donald, why must you always play me a fool? Everyone all over town is talking about your house spawn that you had. <laughs> With Laura Loomer. I know everything, Donald. Loose, furious, frumpious. You think I don't know, Donald? You think I'm stupid, Donald? Uh, 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 Melania, listen. I can explain. I can explain. Of course you can explain, Donald. You're a pig. You're a piece of shit. I always knew you were, Donald. And you know what? Now you're worth nothing. So I've already talked to the lawyers. I'm getting a divorce. I'm leaving you. And I've already moved on. Everything going okay over here, babe? Yes, Bill. Everything is going fantastic. Donald, this is my new boyfriend, Bill Gates. He's a real billionaire. And he has girth, the likes of which you will never have. Hey, Donald. I have a really big dick. Jesus f***ing Christ, Bill f***ing Gates, ah, what the f***? Wow, so the stories are true. I can't believe it. I mean, the greatest president ever now sitting behind a counter at a convenience store? This isn't real life. I can't believe this is happening. Such a fall from grace. This is, what a catastrophe, man. I, I am so sorry. Uh, man, at least you have Melania. At least you have your family, you know? Um, you and Melania have been together for, man, how long have you guys been together? It feels like forever. You know, that's what you got to lean into right now. At least you have her. Hey, bud, are, are you listening? Are you there? Donald, are you good? Well, it was good seeing you, Donald. Great talk. Take care. You're not just losing a person, you're losing everything you thought you knew. All the order, all the stability, you took it for granted, it's now gone. The foundation of your life has cracked and it's not going to be the same again. It's like you've been living in a house, thinking it's solid, and now you've realized it's rotting underneath you this whole time. And that's the most terrifying thing, when you realize how fragile everything is. One little shift and the whole structure collapses and there is no going back, not in the way it was. This is what people don't understand about chaos. It's always lurking, just waiting for the right moment. You lose someone and it feels like the whole world is ending because in a way it is. Not just your world, but the world you knew as you knew it. What was familiar, gone. What was safe, gone. And what do you have left? Uncertainty. This black hole of not knowing what comes next. And maybe, maybe this is just how it ends for you. Maybe this is the beginning of a slow, agonizing decay. Relationships fall apart, meaning disappears, and you spiral into something much darker. It happens. You've seen it. People sinking into despair, becoming hollow versions of who they once were. It's not some dramatic fall. It's this quiet, relentless erosion. And what's the worst part? No one can pull you out of it. No one is coming to save you. So I, I heard Melania is leaving you, huh? Hey, Donald. Stormy Daniels, what do you want? I just thought I'd come by and say hello. It's been so long since we've seen each other, Donald. How have you been? How's life treating you? It looks like it must be doing so well. I mean, look at this amazing convenience store you work at. You really, and your family. Man, I've heard your family is growing. Uh, I've seen the hell spawn all over town. Who do you think told Melania about it, Donald? Donald, payback's a bitch. And you are a piece of shit.
Okay, thanks, bye. Hey Donald, I hope there's no hard feelings. I mean, I hope you could see where I'm coming from. I hope you could see my perspective, you know? I mean, you had turned your whole Naga army on me. They were spreading the craziest misinformation and conspiracies. I mean, there was these crazy microchip conspiracy theories that were talking about how I created it in, in its entirety. I mean, it, Things were so out of control and you did nothing about it. I was like, I'm gonna get him back. I'm gonna show him. I'm gonna nail his wife. And now I'm doing it six ways to Sunday, three times a day, baby. And she can't get enough of it. So yeah, go fuck yourself, Donald.